Hey, what is good with y'all? It's your boy KAG, and today we're gonna be talking about the Nintendo NX and the possibility of it being an augmented reality console. Rather than looking at it from the virtual reality side, which a lot of people want to look at and say that, hey, maybe Nintendo's working on something virtual reality related, but it doesn't necessarily have to be the case. So without any further ado, let's hop into this episode. Now, Reggie recently had an interview with Bloomberg and he had this to say. For Nintendo, we want to make sure technology is mainstream. We want to make sure that the technology represents strong value to the consumer. So the way we look at VR or even AR, which we have within our Nintendo 3DS system, for us the technology has to be at a point where it can be mainstream. And then it takes content creating companies like us to really make things the consumers want to experience, that they want to jump into the particular technology, that's how we move it forward. We've been looking at the VR space since the days of the Virtual Boy. With us, we want to make sure our next content is going to be mainstream, mass market approachable, and when something like VR is at that point, you can expect Nintendo to be there. And that's what he had to say regarding actual virtual reality. But you know, in all actuality, Nintendo has been messing with augmented reality a lot more than they have been with VR especially inside of their consoles and handhelds. Like for example, you have your Nintendo 3DS, which does 3D and it somewhat brings things into your actual room and you have the little cards, the little AR cards, where you can play games and shoot at things that are in your room through the actual screen of the device. Now, if you look at the Nintendo Wii, I mean the Wii U, shall I say. But anyways, if you look at that, uh, they actually have a case where you can actually look at a city through the screen of your Wii U gamepad. But with all that being said, there is the possibility that the NX could have some type of AI capability. Like for example, what if they actually went ahead and they expanded the environment of the game outside of the actual screen? So for example, if you're playing a game like Legend of Zelda, maybe you would see leaves or something come through the screen. Or if somebody's shooting an arrow at you, maybe the arrow would come outside of the screen. Now this is a possibility that they could be working on something similar to this. Whether or not it's, you know, via like the actual controller. Because we have seen patents for a all-screen controller, which is supposed to be more immersive in the actual gaming community rather than the standard gamepad like you have with the Wii U. But then again, it could be a possibility where there is some type of headset, but rather than blocking you and locking you inside of a virtual space like VR does, it allows you to be able to see your surrounding around you. So you could be inside of your living room, you can look to the left, you can look to the right, and you can still see your house, you can still see what's going on, but you have game elements that are actually are coming inside of your room which I think would actually be a better take and then once we have that being done then move forward into the VR space because a lot of people don't want to go ahead and put a VR headset on and be trapped in a space where they have no idea what's going on around them but in this case you could actually wear a more transparent VR headset that may be able to link up with your controller of some sorts and be able to actually see around your room but then again, you have, let's, let's say you're playing Mario Kart, you may have a turtle shell that will shoot outside of your room. Or maybe you'll have, if you're playing a Mario game, maybe you'll have blocks and grass and other random things that are set up in your room to make it more immersive. So rather than you just playing a game on a screen, that screen now becomes or your room, shall I say, becomes an environment. And that's what they're trying to do with The Legend of Zelda. Is they're trying to break you more immersed into the environment of The Legend of Zelda. That's why the world is so huge. That's why it's so expansive. Because they want to bring the player more in tune with the game. But VR, on the other hand, is a little on the extreme side. So rather than doing that, we go with AR which allows you to be inside your room but brings game elements inside your room, it would be a lot better, a lot more people would be more interested in trying it. 
But anyways, that's all I had for y'all today. Let me know what y'all think about it. Would y'all like to have the environment of your games that you play actually be encompassed inside of your room? I think it's a pretty cool idea if we actually did it appropriately, if it was done accurately. I think it could work. You look to the left, look to the right, and you see parts of the environment of the game. So you're no longer blocked inside of the screen of your television or your handheld device. It expands outward. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button. And as always, don't forget to subscribe if you're new to this channel. And it's your boy KAG, and I'm signing out. Peace.